trams have been running in Kolkata for over 140 years. They are unique to the city and have added to its cultural and economic growth. But now, these trams face a great deal of uncertainty. And without government support and a lack of public interest, there is a fear among tram enthusiasts. Will trams, once an iconic landmark of Kolkata, die? Kolkata was the first city to get the tram system in Asia. It was formally introduced in 1880 with the setting up of the Calcutta Tramways Company. And on February 24, 1873, the first tram was rolled out. In the 1970s, the city had as many as 52 tram routes. In 2019, this came down to just six. The COVID-19 pandemic and Cyclone Amphan led to the closure of three more routes. In 2022, the historic route number no. 5, connecting Esplanade and Sham Bazaar areas, was suspended due to metro construction. Now, only two routes remain functional. History shows that a route once shut has never been resumed, even when the closure was meant to be temporary. The number of passengers, staff and daily revenue on these trams have dwindled. But members of the Calcutta Tram Users Association have been fighting for the restoration of services. They feel trams should be made a more integral part of transportation in Kolkata. It could help in reducing traffic snarls in a city like Kolkata which has the lowest road space among India's major metro cities. Trams are also a clean mode of transport. At a time when the world is fighting climate change and skyrocketing fuel prices, trams which neither emit smoke nor consume fuel could be the way to go forward.